Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Dawn of Twilight Plus. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and it turns out this wasn't a dead end, a uh, dead end trap after all. <laughs> Silly me, but oh well, after the first couple times it happened, you can understand me being wary of it. And... Oops, yep, grab the bomb that way. And what do we have here? We've got ghosts of all sorts, and I thought that was a wind guy for a moment there. Okay, first things first. These... I, I think the battle needs to go first. There we go. Alright, come on. Bats, die, please. And there is the book. So, all that's left for the, this place is the center portion through the boss door. But, the fact that I now have the book means only one thing. And you know what that thing is. Time to take on this place. So I'll just make sure that works. Yes, okay. So let's see what this monstrosity has to offer. Welcome, this is the Tower of Wisdom. It is here your mind and knowledge will be tested. I am so screwed. Your knowledge about various aspects of your journey here will be practiced. A worthy weapon will be rewarded if you complete this. Along the way, you will be asked questions about things you have seen. I am really screwed! You will then be given two choices of answers. Get it right, and you will advance onwards. Get it wrong, though, and you will not only have to fight a potent enemy, but you will be taken back to the start of this trial. You are allowed to retry for no price, though, so be persistent. If you clear the questions and the final foe up top, you win. Good luck, and know that knowledge is the greatest power. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Not sure what I was expecting by Tower of Wisdom, but yeah. I'm... How many red rupees were in the forest? Oh, jeez. How am I supposed to remember that? Uh, I think there were th three? Well, okay, I got that one right. Except, apparently not. Apparently I didn't get that one right, huh? Oh, I guess I did. What was the name of the fifth main dungeon? Miras Trench. Alright. Well, I guess I have to fight enemies regardless. I don't know. I guess I'll see what happens if and when I get one wrong. Uh. Alright, come on, you. There we go. Next. What? Second floor! Oh, jeez. How many gravestones were in the graveyard area? What? Not including big ones. <laughs> um. 64? Eh. Oh, dear. So... Will it start me back at the st top, at the start of the floor, or at st at the very beginning of everything? Because if it did that, that would be kind of mean. Man, this place is end game. It's not really supposed to be nice, but having to go through the entire place, considering how yes, I do have to go through the whole thing again. Okay. Well, now I know it was 56. 
So how far does this go if the... Oh my. Spread shot Lionels. That is certainly interesting. Never seen those before. Though I have a feeling I would be seeing them in Den of Evil. Alright, what's the next one? What was the name of the leader of Wizard's Hollow? Zernak, right? Yes! Oh, jeez. Bunnies. Magic bunnies. Yep. Uh, uh, you know what? I can stun these guys just fine. I, I don't need to waste my magic on that. The fact that it restored my ma this uh, they restored my magic to full at the start of this thing kind of makes me wonder. What was the boss of Deep Darkness? In the original version of this quest, what? Uh... What? How the heck am I supposed to know that? I'm gonna say Death Knight. Dang it. Oh! Okay, so... That's good to know. The blue mummies are immune to the boomerang. And they... And they're freaking bubbles! Are... What? <laughs> um... Will the hook shot... I don't think the hook shot will work against these guys, will they? No, it won't. Ha! Well, it's a good thing I'm planning this little feature out in a controlled environment. Oh, jeez. Seriously, how the heck am I supposed to know that answer? Oh boy. Uh are these beefed up? Beefed up bomb rocks? Okay. Next oh geez, there's another floor, of course there is. X eh? Given the money progression, I figured there was gonna be at least one more question. Huh. Of course, given the nature of how things tend to be, I I really shouldn't have made assumptions about anything. Your mind is wise. Well done. However, to claim the Aegis Blade, you must now face the tower's guardian. Zartellus awaits you. Zartellus, huh? Oh, jeez. Oh, it's one of those. Oh, no, he's not one of those. And the boomerang does nothing. Can I... Yes, I can. Yes, the hammer does work, but it doesn't get rid of the shield. Not that I would care over much. As long as I'm dealing damage. And he's not dealing damage back to me. Ah. But you know what? That explains the 200 rupees that were outside the tower. Oh, jeez. Didn't think I'd be using a potion here, but... Frankly, I don't want to die here. Especially if it's to my own incompetence. Well, 
Well, there we go. The Aegis Blade. Whee! Go ahead and... You know, I am going to go ahead and reap my spoils, because those 200 rupees over here... Darn it, I'm getting it. Plus, I want to see just how strong this thing is. <laughs> yep! One-shotting whiz robes from a distance. I like. And I still have sword beams at less than full health. Okay. I like even more. So... Now that I've accomplished that, it, frankly it didn't take very long, I'm going to go ahead and head back to the Den of Evil. I will see you guys there. Alright, I'm back to where I was before, and for the record, I did not buy a new potion because I am brazen and a pun button for punishment. At least now I know about these guys. About knowing about these stupid bubble gyptos is definitely a good thing. Cause it would have been bad to discover that here. Uh, apparently there is a limit to how much health I need to get sword beams, but oh well. <laughs> Alright, boss time I suppose. Yep. Oh uh, yeah, there's a two, of, two of them. Not that it matters that much. Hey, a fairy. Why thank you. Oh, jeez. So, invisible statue shooters with bunnies and fire ropes. Oh, boy. What's next? Oh no. Oh dear. Oh, uh -huh. so I can take them out in two hits. Just like that. Alright. You know what? I have it. There's magic restoration right there. Might as well make some use of this. What? Bomb robes? What the heck is up with this? Um, uh huh. Okay. More splitters. Fine. I'll take that. I think that was more health than I had at the start of this room. Though that feels looks kind of odd, but oh well. Oh, jeez. <laughs> All right, you. Thank you. you. You did exactly what I wanted you to do. Thank you for being cooperative. 
Hey! You know what? Might as... Might as well. Didn't kill all of them, but... It made some headway, and anything under here? No. Next? Oh, jeez. Okay, next boss. What is oh my. See, this is what I thought I would might need the silver arrow for, because these things tend to be kind of resistant. Okay, I didn't actually get hit there. Wow. I got hit there, though. Thought I might have gotten that one. Holy cow! How many hits does it take to kill you? Too many! That's how many. There we go. Another fairy. Well, okay. That's fine. Go ahead and use the one I've got, and buy one from you since I've got plenty of money now after the Tower of Wisdom. Next, oh jeez. Yeah, I've, I feel a bit better about things having seen some of these enemies before. Because if not, that would have... <laughs> I will probably be in a panic. Okay, come on. Alright, so that's down to one. Now it's just a matter of that one coming close to me. Thank you. Alright, actually came close uh, came close to actually I was able to kill them all in one shot that time. Oh my Well that's an interesting room. Oh my Ten Uber blues, I guess. Oh dear. Makes me really glad I got the sword upgrade for this. Wait. That's... <laughs> Why the heck not? Pull out all the dang stops. I'm just glad I remembered I had that thing in that particular moment. Oh jeez, the bomb guy's back! Ooh, okay. Ah, uh, hey. Uh-oh. Oh dear. Oh, okay, th there, that turned out well. These are level three. Oh, th it's a two and a three.
Uh, uh. Whew, okay. I'm just glad I got the potion off. And I'm gonna try to make full use of these sword beams, or maybe not. Do I still have sword beams? Yes, so I guess I just need more than, at least more than 75% health to get sword beams, alright. Hey, is there going to be another potion shop here? No, but I'll take the ferry. Oh, jeez. Uh, pertinent question. Will these things hurt them? Yes. But it will only do so much. But darn it, it's damage. Uh, yeah, these, these work too. Stop walking into them. Eh. Well, at least my health is still pretty good. But for how long? Oh, okay, there's still one more snake out there. Yeah, things are definitely... Okay. I don't know why you're sending these guys after me all of a sudden, but I'll take whatever leniency I'll, I'll get at this point. Oh. <laughs> oh, really? That is just... That is mean. To come all this far only to get hit by one of those guys? No thank you. And level 4 Garayas. Okay. What? I say again. What? Um... Will this thing work against that? No, it will not! And I'm taking a full heart of damage, so I'm getting my potion ready now. Except it didn't actually do anything. What? Oh, darn it. Oh, boy. Okay, how do I want to go about this? Laying lots of bombs would probably be very effective here. Except, maybe... Well, that... It's doing a lot of damage. Okay. I am, I am not taking any chances now. Not after coming, having to come this far again. Oh yeah. Please let there be another potion shop here. No. Uh. Yeah, sure. Why not? 
Final stretch of thing. <sighs> really? Yeah, just tank my way through this because these guys are not worth as much effort as they would like to think. Oh, hello. Yep, that certainly did a lot. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen this much this much money in one room at one time. That that was a lot. <laughs> oh boy. Next. There's probably a better way to go about that, but oh well. That requires planning, strategy, and active thought, and I sometimes wonder if I'm capable of such a thing. Oh, uh, bomb guy, you're going first. Hey, I'm getting some of my bombs back for whatever that's worth. Hey, I'm still making... These bats are no threat to me, it seems. Whew. And it's another one of you guys. That's two. Just need four more hits, please. Three, four, five, six. Thank you! That was a little chaotic, but I think it went rather well. Oh boy, what's this guy? It's just a mishmash of everything that I've faced up to this point. Okay. How the heck am I supposed to dodge that? Especially when I put myself that close, willingly. Hey. What? What do we have? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Yes. Thank you so much for that. I feel so much better. So what? Fairy. Calling it Death Knight. No, it's not. Uh, should I recognize who that Wizrobe is? Was that Zernak? I think so. Well, okay, that was easy. Probably gonna find myself using the hammer more often than the sword just because it allows me to do more. to actually hit more reliably. Although, if I can hit from here and do more damage with the sword beams, that works out nicely too. After all that, after what this place put me through, I think this boss fight is kind of anticlimactic. Because you notice I fought this guy once already. In the same video. Uh. And purple ring. Oh my, thank goodness. Whew. And yeah. 
This video might be is probably going to be a bit long, but darn it, it was worth it. So, join me next time when I head back into level 9 and see see really what else is left to do there. So, until then, this is Melee Wizard and have a nice day. Ooh.